play DJ Hero on our big screen. Plus, you can get your picture taken for hot1063.com. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I want you to keep your ears and eyes to the sky. in our business. His name is Kevin Coleman, who just Tuesday of last week turned 20 years old. Watch him as he climbs through 2,000 feet above the ground and does his high show for us right here at our show. Diving back down now, building up energy, closing in on that 500 foot hard deck. Goes into the field of our Extra 300, slow rolling up the line. Now watch him as he rolls the other direction. Continues to roll to the left. And he hangs it on the propeller and backs it up. This is the torque roll. Watch this. Continues to turn. The engine turns one way. The propeller turns one way. The aircraft turns the other. Quickly swaps in. A quick aileron roll vertically going down line. And he picks up his energy once again. Over 200 miles per hour. This is called the Nickelator, named after the late Nick Millmeyer, a friend of Kevin's and many of the air show business. Look at that tumble. Well, yeah, that's the Nickelator. Kevin's coach, Bill Stein, one of Kevin's coaches. Bill Stein helps him teach that, helps him learn that, and now he does the same. He goes outside, shoulder rolls across the show line, 180 miles per hour. With all the blood rushing into his head and making him see red. He does one half now that Octagon blue. He'll pull 45, work in the energy just the best he can, and now across the top. Watch him accelerate out of it, roll the airplane upright. Now watch the nose come up. He'll bleed off the energy and set up for what we call the mini loop. A beautiful barnstormer's loop at only of about 300 feet of altitude. Kevin Coleman, ladies and gentlemen, give this newcomer a big round of applause. Now he's going to set up for another loop in just a moment. As he tumbles the airplane, airplane first with a knife edge tumble, turns it back around. That's the left, the Louisiana left, left as he calls it. A lot of left rudder, a lot of left stick. Now, at 500 feet, he's got the energy. He does a quick four-point roll. Demonstrating the extra this extra 300, but up at the top, he's gonna do some snap rolls. Not one, not two, but three. Holds it inverted and pulls on through. A barnstormer's look with three snap rolls. It's called the triple avalanche. Kevin's a full-time Watching his dad and older brother perform, he soloed on his 16th birthday in a Cessna 150. Got his license on his 17th birthday and his commercial license on his 18th. That whole line on that 45. There's 190. Right there at 500 feet. He's been taught aerobatics by the legendary Marion Cole. He's also been coached by Sean D. Tucker, Michael Goulian, and Bill Stein, three of the best pilots anywhere. A perfect hammerhead stall turn with zero airspeed, kicks hard on the left rudder pedal, turns on a dime, gives you nine cents change. Kevin has competed at the Aerobatic Championship at the young age of 18, third in the national level. He plans to continue flying air shows and pursue a full-time sponsorship after graduating from college. He wants to thank his dad, his family, Marion Cole, Sean D. Tucker, Michael Goulian, and Bill Stein. He also wants to thank his sponsors, MT Propeller, Shaden Precision Eyewear, Oregon Arrow, and Skytech Starters. Ladies and gentlemen, a big round of applause for Kevin Cole! Take his parade lap right in front of the crowd to taxi by. 
He's going to set up here to land on runway 16. And we've got lots more to come today. It is a busy, busy day, including a demonstration in just a couple of minutes by the C-130 Hercules, the J-model Hercules from the Rhode Island Air National Guard, the 143rd Airlift Wing. Kevin's on his way in. We want to thank our great sponsors, including Cerrone, Chevy GMC Buick with 20 years supporting this great air show. Al, thank you very much. And Al has given me a, a, a very, very unique vehicle to drive while I'm here. It's a Chevy Avalanche. It's out in front of us here at Show Center, and it's got signage on it. It's the salute to the armed services with the Air Force, the Army, the Navy, the Coast Guard, the Marine Corps, the Guard, and the Reserves. Kevin's down on the ground. There's that German-built Extra 300. For years, biplanes ruled aerobatic competition, and then the development of composite materials that are able to withstand very, very high G loading. Uh, they, have, uh, they have changed the way a lot of people fly, and these monoplanes now that only weigh about 1,200 pounds are, are dominating the sport of aerobatic competition and uh, even the Red Bull Air Race World Championship. This one, MT Propeller, a light combing engine, and uh, Walter Extra was the designer builder in Germany. And we've got this, this particular one flown by the newcomer, Kevin Coleman. He's gonna come by, so when he goes by, you give him a big old wave. We have a 12-year-old male named Samuel. He's got white sleeveless uh, shirt and gray sports shorts and with a VIP pass for the media tent and an orange headset. So if anybody sees Samuel, maybe you can uh, direct him toward uh, one of the uh, uniformed members here from the guard on the base and we'll get him reunited with his parents. We'll get us all set up. Skydive Newport's airplane on the landing roll. Uh, just about ready to...